everybody! So a while ago, I got a menstrual cup from Suchi Sisters. They sent me the size B1. There are two sizes. If you want to check out what the size is for, you can head into their IG. So I have the chance to finally use this. And when I got this, a few guys were asking me, how do you use it? How does it feel like? So I'm going to show you guys and tell you guys how it goes. First, you want to prop the cup in hot water for three to five minutes. Let it dry. Very good angle. So I'm going to put this in. I've already popped it. I'm done everything. Wash my hands. I'm actually really nervous. And I went to their website to make sure that I got it correct. Okay, so take it out. And wet it a little. Okay. Oh, it's really good. Okay, so I'm going to put it in Fold it like this. I actually got it like for my first try. Okay, let me explain why the video got like hanged it was because after I, I redid it, I felt like the bottom tip of the cup like really went in and I panicked a little bit. So that's when I I DM this the sushi cup and I I DM my cousin to ask if it was normal because I started panicking a little bit, but apparently it's normal. So I inserted the cup at 11.30 and now it's around 3.30 and because it's my first day so I felt it being very heavy like you could just feel it and I took it out and I actually made a big mess but it's my first time taking it out so I guess that's cool I panicked a bit because it made a mess because the cup was full and this is my second day of so it's day two wearing the cup. So far, I feel nothing. I woke up at 7 a.m. because I felt like it was full, clean it, but it was not full, surprisingly. It was half. Then I put it in really easily. Like I just knew how to do it. It was so cool. And then now I have I changed it at 3 p.m. I took it out again. Uh, it still wasn't full, but I just felt like it. And I put it in very easily too. And so far I've feel really clean, has no mess in, and I'm and I'm loving it. It feels so good. So this is my day three using the cup and I feel so good. I feel so clean. It doesn't hurt. It feels natural. Actually Samalam I was going to bed and I was like oh shit I forgot I have the cup. So I, I forgot that I had it on because it doesn't feel anything. So here is my timing for the cups that I inserted. On a normal daily basis, you can use it up to 10 hours, but it also depends on your flow. My flow is actually really low. Like I don't get heavy bleeding, except for the first day. So the first day I inserted it at, at 11.30 and then I took it out at 3.30. I could just feel it being full, true enough when I took it out. It was full because I made a bit mess, but it was my first time taking it out, so I guess that's cool. That's okay. The first two timed myself for four hours because my first round was four hours. In four hours' time, it was supposed to be at 8 p.m., but I just like tried to tuck high. And then uh, at nine, almost to 10, I took it out again, and it was half, so I guess that's fine. So that was day one of using the cup. So for day two, I emptied the cup out three times because my flow was half. So I tried to aim for six hours. So I did it the first time when I woke up, the second time when throughout the day, the third time when before I was going to sleep, true enough, the whole time was like half, half cup. And for ending of day two, my cup was half. So in day three, the next morning when I woke up, I left the cup in for about more than 10 hours the cup my period was like a little bit but that was my experience wearing the menstrual cut i would recommend it because after like on day one after inserting it for like two three times you become a pro at it because i came a pro at it knew when like how to angle myself how to put it in how to take it out 
So yeah, if you guys like to ask me any more questions about using the card, please do slide into my DMs. I really don't mind asking any questions. And you guys should definitely try it. I got my cup from Suchi Cup. So their website, their Instagram, like, really teaches you how to use the cup. So there's no panic. You can actually gain really much knowledge for it. So check that out. So yeah. So thank you for listening to my TED Talk about menstrual cup. <laughs>